adventure mode where I can oh, go around and I can't hurt anything but the mobs and a button the map maker has given me a button that says surprise I click it and what happens oh cookies I hit it again and more cookies isn't this awesome ha <laughs> ha and again more cookies this is absolutely amazing I've got an infinite cookies wait where'd my cookies go Where'd my cookies go? So here you go, folks. This is a limited use tutorial, or a tutorial for a limited use item dispenser using the new command block. Let me take you into creative mode, and I will show you how this system works. It's actually really simple. I'm going to go ahead and grab myself some more sand blocks to reset it. Basically, what you've got is get your button feeding redstone through sand blocks and depending on how number of sand blocks you place determines how many uses this thing can have up to 12 unless you go through some elaborate system and extend it beyond that um, or find a better way to handle the sand themselves because you can always just actually no yeah you can make this nearly infinite depending on what size of the world you put it at and all that or even drop the blocks here on top of a torch uh, let's go find a torch so yeah that that's another easy way to do it if you really wanted to go that way you can make the sand drop onto the torch after it pushes it then you could go beyond the 12 limit so um I've got as it goes here, which powers this redstone block, which goes into this pulse limiter. Um, this pulse limiter is required to keep the uh, piston from firing more than once. And so what will happen is this pulse limiter ticked at three. Um, one, two didn't work. Four might. I don't know. But anyway, that keeps this going and uh, causes the piston to fire off, reducing the number of uses available, as well as fires off the new command block. Um, for information on the command block, you probably have to check it out somewhere else. Um, the command I'm using right now is uh, give cookies, eight cookies, to every player. Um, oops, didn't mean to do that. Um, so now you'll see this is the an example of the single use in the command block. It just pushes it once and that's it, and then you can't do it anymore. But if we were to maybe add more here, um, you adventure map makers can maybe make a way to give bonus items so you could have like some other system set up on top to add even more blocks onto it. Who knows, you know, if they complete this portion, they can do that. But this is going to be a great tool for, um, for, for being able to actually, uh, you know, limit the amount of times that they can use this command block um, and all that. So I, I look forward to seeing what some of you guys can do here with this new command block. Um, so please feel free to leave me your feedback here. Any suggestions on improving the system or what can be done to uh, make it... Oh, well, that's weird. I wonder why that... Oh, because it pushed it. That doesn't work. It has to go down one more. So yeah, there we go. That should actually... Oops, I did not mean to adjust that piston. Uh, I mean the timer. So there we go. That should uh, make it drop right there, right? Yeah, and that makes it go away forever. So you could always have it drop on a half slab with some lava on top of it or something. I don't know. Also different different ways you can deal with it, uh, depending. But um, this is your limited use uh, command block item dispenser. So uh, again, I look forward to hearing from you guys. Thanks for watching.